Real quick, real quick, let me bust this down. Black people love lies, bro. Our people love lies, bro. The black man, the Native American and Hispanic man, the 12 tribes of Israel love lies. They hate the truth. I'm going to give you an example of that. White Jesus. They have accepted white Jesus in their home, in their church. Wherever you go on Google, every image, they don't have a problem. They can look at those images of white Jesus all day long and never have a problem. The first time that you show them that is no proof in the Bible of the images that's been sold all around the world, that's all on Google, that's all in the churches, in their home, is historically wrong. And you show them in the Bible the real proof. You show them the dream that Daniel had. You show them that John, who sat at the table with Jesus Christ when he was alive, before he got killed, knew his color because he was a man. And every man have a color. So he knew the color of Jesus Christ. Remember, John, the revelator, wrote Revelation. Revelation 1 tell you how Jesus Christ co-signed it, hey, for him to write it. He gave him the permission to write everything that he saw. In Revelation 1, 14 and 15, it gives you the description of what he saw. The same description that Daniel had in his dream way before that time even came. But when you bring this out, they hate to hear that. They don't want to talk about that. You're being racist. Black people love lies. They love the lie that they have been taught. I'm going to give you another one. Come as you are. Where that's at in the Bible? Ain't no come as you are. It's a dress code. And you know what come as you are have turned into? Women wearing pants that's way too tight. Or wearing pants, period. Coming in there where you can see their whole shape. You have homosexuality going on in the church. Homosexual men come in there in comfort because the pastor then told them, come as you are. They done took it to a whole nother level. You got women wearing short, short skirts or wearing skirts so tight that you can see their whole shape. Now, you can't help how some of our sisters are shaped, but some of them just go overboard. Some of them go overboard. They wear it tight like that on purpose because he said, come as you are. They love that lie. But when you tell them, hey, that ain't what the Bible say. Look, in this chapter, they tell you that you got to have on fringes. And he say you got to wear that throughout all your generations. When he say throughout all your generations, that's forever. That's forever. Women supposed to dress in modesty. They supposed to have a wrap on their head or something covered in their head. They body don't supposed to be shown where you can see their whole shape and stuff like that. Like I said, some sisters, you can't help it. I'm just saying, it's a certain way to dress modest, and it's in the Bible. They hate the true dress code that the Bible gives them. They love the lie. Come as you are. They love that. Our people hate the truth of the Bible, fam. They hate the truth. They love the lie. I'm going to give you another one. They love the lie of the fake Jews being the real Jews. They love that lie. They hate the truth of what Revelation 2 and 9 and Revelation 3 and 9 say. They hate that. They hate it when it show you that they not the real Jews. They the synagogue of Satan. They hate that truth. Recorded in the earth to be the people of the book. This is why you receive billions of dollars for United States government and Britain. You know what I'm saying? This is why you were able to come in in 1948 and take over that land. Because the earth believes that you are the people of the book. But historically, it show, we know from scripture and history that you're not the people of the book. Even your top rabbis know that you are gen you're not genetically linked to Abraham, Isaac, the, and Jacob, or the twelve tribes. How did they get to? How did they? How did they get to be where they are? How did, in 740 A.D., the Khazarian Empire, your people primarily come from, converted. Exactly. Judaism. And that's found in your own Jewish encyclopedias with no problem. So what's the, 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 the fact of the matter is the real children of Israel who were a quote unquote Negro type of people, the Ashkenaz have been purported. When you really peel back the onion, peel back the layers, they hate the Bible. 
They hate the Bible. They like vain words from men. T.D. Jakes, uh, 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 Creflo Dollar, Juanita Bynum, why she preaching to men when she don't supposed to be doing that. And on top of that, she's preaching with no fringes on, just like the rest of them, but I'm, finna, I'm singling her out right now. On top of that, bro, she ain't got no rap on her head when she talking. Women supposed to be silent in the churches. That's in the Bible. This is why men supposed to dominate the woman. It's, it's, it's prophetic. It's in the book. He made Adam first, fam. When you think, when you say one man, ain't no woman without man. It's in the title. One man. Now, when you say man, ain't no woman in the title. When you say be male, it's still male in the title. When you say male, ain't no woman in the title. The scripture already done told you the, the, the order of God. At the head of every woman is man. That means he's on top of you. You listen to him. At the head of every man is Christ. That means he listened to Christ. At the head of Christ is God. That means he listened to his father. That's why the scriptures say you can't get to your father unless you go through me. Because it's an order. You know another lot they love? Independent women. All that stuff they preach about women being independent and you don't need a man and X, Y, Z, da, 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 da. Everything that, that they stand for. No. The woman was made to be a helper of man. They hate that truth. It ain't no happy wife, happy life. That's a lie. They love that lie. No. She was made to help man. Her job is to make man happy. Now, it's okay to make your woman happy after the man has been helped. After he has been helped and took care, then it's cool. But that's why it's an order. I'm not telling you not to make sure your wife is happy because that you, sh you should do that. You should do that. After the man has been taken care of. Man, y'all sleeping, fam. They hate the truth of what this book say. They hate the fact that you can't celebrate pagan holidays. They hate that. They hate that. They love Christmas. They love the lies, bro. Black people love lies. They love that right now is New Year, but they hate the fact that it's really not New Year. <laughs> New Year came after Moses uh, brought, brought us out of Egypt. It was a celebration, the month of Abib. That's the real New Year, fam. The New Year was when the spring uh, began after the winter end. That's when the New Year came in the Bible. You can Google when that was transformed from Caesar himself. You can Google, because y'all love the white man, Google. You can Google when uh, Caesar changed the new year from the month of a bib that's in the Bible, which means, again, when the winter ends and the new year begins. That's the new year. That's the new year, fam. Black people love lies. They love lies. They love the lie they've been told of what John the 3.16 means. They hate the fact that this book is only for Israel. He only stole his statutes and judgments to Jacob and his whole co uh, commandments to Israel. They hate that. They hate that salvation is only for the Jews. They want it to be for everybody. Why? Why? You think if the, the role was the other way around? Look at America today and look how Esau treat your brother. Look at all the police brutality that happened in America. What color are the people that they happened to? We not going to say that it don't happen to Esau, but we never see it. What happened to that dude that went and killed them 10 people? Have they showed you an update about that? What about that? They just swept that under the rug. Black people just keep on going about that like eating sandwiches and stuff, huh? That don't, make, that don't mean nothing, huh? What you worry about him for? No. The books say that's your problem, fam. You that scared of them? You can't be scared of God because you ain't following the Sabbath. So you that scared of the white man? You can't be scared of God because you following pagan traditions. So it can't you can't say you doing this because God say love everybody. No, you can't be saying that. That's an excuse. You are scared of the white man because he give you housing, food stamps. If you 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 using his medicine, his technology, you scared of him. You ain't scared of God. He gonna kill all them people. Pam, you already just said that. 
You love his lies. You love his lies. You ain't scared of God. You can't say, you can't use that as an excuse. You love his fake solar system. You love that. You love that. When God had told you that this whole world is surrounded by water, it's affirming it. That's on the very first page of the Bible. That just let me know people don't read the book. That's on the very first page of the Bible. Say, man, listen to him, bro. Let me, let, let me, let me break this down real quick. Y'all love lies so much. Y'all love lies so much. Y'all haven't even put together the first page of the Bible. He rested on the seventh day, right? Everybody know that, right? That means he told you everything he built in the six days, right? Right. So what are they looking for when they looking through a telescope? You, what you looking for up there? He already told you what he done built in the first six days. He told you everything he built. What are you looking for? What you calling God a lie? What is a lie, though, is that the sun is out of space when it's under the firmament. That's a lie that you've been told. That's a lie you've been told. They done told you that the sun was a star. That's another lie you've been told. He said he built the sun, the moon, and the stars. How is the sun a star? Man, listen. Black people love lies. They hate the truth. Let me give you another example. Black women hate their natural look. They love the lie that they've been told of what beauty really is. They're going to buy fake hair, fake nails, everything on their body, heels, everything that tall. Now they want fake, fake ass, fake breasts. Nothing on them is true. What's real? What's real? You want a real man when everything about you is fake. Black people hate the truth. They love the lie. The truth is the other nations don't care nothing about you. Them people that, that you go buy your chimichan from and you go buy your nails and get your nails done, Mayling and all them, they don't care nothing about you, man. Where Mayling stay? Well, how many children Mayling got? Where her children go to school at? I don't want to hear nothing about Mayling. Mayling taking your money. When they when y'all going to buy chimichan, them oils and they using on that, that's to kill you, fam. God say don't eat that. But y'all love the lie. Y'all love how they taste, huh? Y'all love that crawfish. That they, all that stuff that they, 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 they make down there in Louisiana, the, the crawfish and the crab. Y'all love that. Y'all love that. Because black people love the lie. The truth is, you don't supposed to eat that. That's going to kill you. That's the truth. But it tastes good, huh? You lying to me. Black people love lies. The scriptures say you the salt of the earth. That means you give everything flavor. Why you think they using everything that's black? When, they, when it's a car commercial, they use hip-hop music. When it's a McDonald's commercial, they use hip-hop music. Any type of thing that the enemy of God try to sell you, they use a hip-hop beat to it. I swear, they stole it from us. Look at Eminem. His swag is like a black man. MGK and all these other white rappers, they, they, they swag like a black man. We the salt of the earth. Imagine eating a steak with no seasoning on it. That's them. What make the steak taste good is the seasoning. That's us. We don't want to see a car commercial with country music. That's them. When we see the car commercial, we uh, uh, resonate with it because of the hip hop that they use. That's why they use it. Why you think they put the rappers on the chips? Because they know what we resonate with. That's the truth, man. The lie is everything they didn't told you. The scriptures say that the world was given to the hand of the wicked. Now think about that. Hmm, who runs the world right now? I wonder. Okay, well, if he say this, the world was given to the hand of the wicked and if they won the world, that explains why every time you see a black man get killed by police, it's at the hand of a white guy. That explains that. The world was giving it to the hand of the wicked. That explains why it ain't no whole foods in the ghetto. Wow, that makes sense. Them people are really that wicked. Ain't no good fruit uh, farmer's markets in the ghetto. Hmm. You know what? I do got to go 
to Sugar Land, Pearland, Stafford, and all that to get to good produce. To go to Whole Foods. Dang, that's wicked. So sick of African Americans being called violent when the world's worst violence was done to them, not by them, to them, not by them. For God's sake, you want to do racist stereotypes if it fit anywhere, and it doesn't. But if it any, fit anywhere, it would certainly fit white right wingers in the South who has hundreds of years of history of being savages. Savages! They snatch babies and they sold them as property and they raped their mothers. Savages! That's what they were. You want to talk about stereotypes? Screw all of you who still defend that confederacy, that monstrosity. Anyone who defends that is a barbaric savage. That's wicked. It's wicked how they make some of the things that you put in your body. Some of the things you put in that, your body, I done seen that they done made uh, granola bars out of roaches. And, 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 and uh, Arizona, I, man, I done seen out. Go look up what they make Arizona out of. Black people, do me a favor. Go look up the things that you love to consume in your body the most. Go look and see what it's really made out of. You'll see the real wicked. You'll see the real wicked. Them people tough, man. They in your neighborhood making money off you. Have you ever seen them outside boating? Black people out there boating. That's the truth. They in your neighborhood making all this money. They got all these businesses in your neighborhood from Timmy Chan's, hair nails, beauty shops, and all this type of stuff, gas stations. They got all this stuff in your neighborhood. But the truth is you ain't never seen them out there with signs trying to get other Arabs or other Chinese people to vote. But yet still they got all these things in your neighborhood. That's the truth. The lie is black people keep voting and things can get better for you. That's the lie, fam. And black people love that. That's why you see them on the corner with the sign trying to get other black people to vote. They love the lie. It ain't never been no Israelite in position. Not no real Israelite. Not, he been, it's been Israelites in position by blood, but he wasn't an Israelite. Meaning that he didn't claim Israelite. When you claim Israelite in your position, you get done like Kanye West. When you claim Israelite and you're in position, you get done like uh, Kyrie Irving. That's the truth. The lies of all these other people who sat down and watched them get rail railroaded and didn't say nothing. They are liars. They are fake. All the other basketball players and all, all the other football players and all the rest of them, they sold them out. They didn't stand up and say nothing. And half of them know the truth. It's disgusting. That's the truth. It's disgusting. They sat there and watched that man get railroaded. That's the truth. The truth is your favorite rapper is not a hero. He's a zero. That's the truth. The truth is the real heroes in this world are who claiming Israelite and showing the world that you are Israelite. Or showing the 12 tribes of Israel that you Israelites and the Bible was written for you. Those are the real heroes. If they ain't on social media using their platform from that, I don't care what they doing. I'm not impressed. Matter of fact, I'm unimpressed that the fact that your platform is big and you not using it for righteousness. Disgusting. That's the truth. A lot of y'all people in position that y'all look up to, they disgust me. That's the truth. The lie is that they happy. That's the lie. That's why every time you see them on TV, you're going to see their teeth. They're going to make you uh, believe that they live in some grand life. But we always see what happened. We seen what happened to Jay-Z and Beyonce in that elevator. We seen it. That's the truth. We seen Cardi B do the video on Black TV. That's the truth. We seen Russell Simmons say what happened to is. That's the truth. God then already told you what success is. If you want to learn that, go back to my last video. I already broke that down, what success really is. I want to stay with the fact that black people love lies. Somebody try to tell you, they have Stockholm Syndrome. They've been lied to for so long. When somebody try to tell them the truth, they're going to say you crazy. They'll say the IUIC is a cult when what they in is a cult. They're not even following the real laws that's actually in the Bible. How you get baptized without the renewing of your mind? Make me understand that. That's another lie you've been told. Y'all being dumped in the water, you still on demon time. 
You're still sleeping around with other people's wives. You're still committing adultery. You're still selling drugs to the community. But you've been dumped in the water. You haven't renewed your mind. But you've been baptized. Disgusting. Disgusting. I watched a video, Jehovah Witnesses. They aren't supposed to be celebrating no holidays. I watched some Jehovah Witness celebrating Christmas. Disgusting. And then when you bust them down, they, I done seen them come to people though. I seen, go look up uh, Jehovah Witness IUIC. Watch when they knock on one of their doors. They send them running. Because you can't run that lie by them. They going to hit you with that truth. And you going to get on by on the block. Where you can talk to somebody else and feed them the lie. And feed them the lie. They're lying. Black people love lies. They love lies. Where in the Bible do Punches Pilate get a chapter? Where in the Bible do Ramsey get a chapter? Where in the Bible do Herod get a chapter? Peter, Israelite. Paul, y'all love Paul, right? Israelite. From the tribe of Benjamin, I might add. Solomon, Israelite. Uh, who else? Matthew, Israelite. Jesus Christ, Israelite. Jacob, Israelite. Saul, Israelite. <laughs> Everybody was Israelites for him.